Hey everyone, Carlo here. Welcome to my watch vlog. This is my YouTube channel that's totally dedicated to watches. Now, if you want to know more about my other YouTube channel, it's all about sneakers and hype and tech. The link to my main channel can be found down below. Now, for today's episode, I'm going to share with you one of the best watches that you can buy for under 4,000 pesos here in the Philippines. That's roughly 90, 80 US dollars. If you want to find out what that is, keep on watching. Let's go. Oh, by the way, stay until the very end. I have a surprise. This is the watch that I'm talking about. This is the Seiko 5 Field Watch Automatic that you can get for under 4,000 pesos. In fact, I bought this one for 3,400 pesos at the at Tokyo shop at the second floor of the podium. Now you're probably thinking why I consider this watch one of the best buys that you can get for under 4,000. It boils down to three things. It's about the craftsmanship, it's about the story, and it's about the overall vibe of the piece. First, let's talk about craftsmanship. You have this stainless steel case, 37 millimeter diameter. It has an in-house automatic movement by Seiko, which means you don't need batteries anymore to power it. All you have to do is to move it around or put it in a winding case so that it can automatically recharge. It has a hard lex crystal, which means that it is shatter resistant, and it even has a really nice skeleton case back, which you can see over here, which reveals the inner workings of the piece. Moving to the watch, very legible, very easy to tell time, and it also has a day-date function. It has a nylon strap as well as a buckle enclosure. Now usually those features from the hard legs crystal to the skeleton back case to the automatic movement, you would only find in watches that are selling for above maybe around seven, 8,000, sometimes even 10,000 pesos, especially if you take a look at some of the younger brands. That's why there's so much value because if you take a look at pure feature to feature, pure craftsmanship and design, I really feel that this is one of the best in terms of bang for your buck. The second thing that I love about this watch is all about the story and the inspiration behind it, which are military field watches. What are military field watches? Military field watches are basically watches that are durable, easy to tell time, reliable movement, doesn't have to be battery powered, shouldn't give up on you, and they're very straightforward and they kind of look cool, right? Now this one is in the black color, but you can also get it in this nice military green color over here that I have. This is actually one of the more popular colors for this particular piece. And we also have it in this navy blue color. Now I've read in one of the comments in one of my vlogs that this is supposed to be inspired by different parts of the military from the Rangers to like the Navy and the Air Force. Not too sure about that but if that's the case then that even makes it even more cool. And lastly I mentioned that I like the vibe of the watch. When you put this on it is unpretentious, it is straightforward, it is practical, it is functional but it is also well built. It kind of communicates that to you, you know what you're doing, you know what you're buying and you bought this with intent and with purpose and that I think is the reason why this is one of the more affordable watches that a lot of watch collectors respect. I, I've seen that in multiple YouTube channels that I've watched in the past and I really I have to agree with them. It's an awesomely well-built watch. Now if you want an option with a steel bracelet, they also have that. That sells a little bit more for around 3,800. You can also find those pieces over at, at Tokyo at the podium second floor and wherever they have branches. I think they also have a branch over at, ah, shucks, I forgot the name of that mall, Uptown Mall BGC. They also have a website, but I'm not too sure if they are still carrying this particular piece. This one usually sells out fast. Now we get to the fun part. Now, I really don't need any of these three watches. Uh, I usually wear chunkier and bigger watches. This one is like 37 millimeters. It's kind of small for my wrist. And the reason I actually bought uh, these pieces is because I want to raffle one of them away, I'll gift the other one, and the other third one I'll probably put it in a mystery box that I'll be selling in our online shop. So what are we going to do? Uh, we're going to do our first giveaway on this watch channel of mine. And the mechanics are very simple. All you have to do is to subscribe to this channel, follow me on Instagram, I'll put a link down below to my Instagram account, you can check it out at the description box. And then all you have to do is to leave a comment which of the three you like and why and include your IG handle. I'll be drawing the winner in two weeks or maybe in a week depending on what we feel like uh, and I will be announcing the winner in the vlog uh, well that will come out 
two weeks from now or maybe a week from now so yeah it, it's free to join you don't have to buy anything so let me know down below which of the three you like and why which color include your ig handle and you get the chance to win one of these three watches and with that said that wraps up this video for the day i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope to see you soon back here on this channel don't forget to join the giveaway doesn't happen often peace god bless what's up boom <laughs>